وما أرسلنا قبلك إلا رجالا نوحي إليهم فاسألوا أهل الذكر إن كنتم لا تعلمون بسم الله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وعلى آله وصحبه ومواله تدى إن شاء الله نكري يوم الكاركتريستيكس نجد 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 Uh, of characteristics according to strong and weak. Uh, they are uh, divided into three groups. First group, uh, the strong characteristics are 11. Uh, the apparent, the strong, the adhesion, the whistle, the elevated, uh, the vibration, the deviation, the repetition, uh, the spreading around, the lengthening, and the nasalization. Uh, two, the weak characteristics are six, the whisper, the weak, the lowering, uh, the open, uh, the ease, and the concealment. Uh, the characteristics that are not described as strong or weak are three, the in-between, uh, the fluency, and the forbidden. Now, the division of the letters according to strong and weak. The, they are divided into uh, five different groups. One, the strongest uh, this, the strongest, this is a letter in which all its characteristics are strong. This is the letter Ta. It is the only letter that has uh, this, which makes it the strongest letter of all. Uh, two, the strong, this is a, a letter which uh, where most of its characteristics are strong. It is uh, eight letters, Qaf, Va, Bad, Sad, Ra, Del, Jim, and Ba. The weak, this is the letter where most of its characteristics are uh, weak. Uh, it's 10 letters. Kaf, uh, Ain, Shin, Sin, Zay, Del, Kha, Ta. And the Wawan, Ya, of the Is, uh, and the, the three med letters. Uh, the weakest, this is the letters uh, where all of its characteristics are uh, weak. Its letters are Tha, Fa, Ha, Ha, and the weakest of all is the letter Ha. Uh, the in between, uh, this is a letter that has an equal number of strong and weak characteristics, which are five letters uh, Hamza, Ghain, Lam, Mim, uh, Noon, and Lam. Yeah, Hamza, Ghain, Lam, Mim, and Noon. Uh, please note. All the characteristics we uh, went through are all essential characteristics, meaning they are part of the letters in all its different pronunciation, whether they are unvoweled, have shadda, uh, voweled, and so on. Uh, every letter from the Arabic letters must have at least one of the characteristics from each of the opposite. Uh, that is, this is the minimum of the characteristics uh, it can have. And then it can take one or two at the maximum from the characteristics that have no opposite. Uh, when the letters uh, when the letters shares uh, the same articulation point, then the characteristics will differentiate between them, uh, as we said before, like sad, zay, and sin. When th when the letters shares the same characteristics, then their articulation point will differentiate between them. Example: uh, the letter bad and va. Uh, the articulation point and uh, uh, the characteristics of the letters are the base of this science, as I told you before. Uh, and all the coming chapters is gonna be uh, uh, is gonna be according to this. If you perfect these two chapters, everything will be easy. Uh, what's coming, and you will be is really gonna be easy for you to learn and easy to practice because they all all the chapters we're gonna study they go back to the Arabic letter and the Arabic letter is based on the characteristics and the sifat. So um, we're gonna go through the letters now with its characteristics. Uh, the first letter is Hamza has five characteristics: apparent, strong, lower, uh, open, and forbidden. The letter Ba has six characteristics, apparent, strong, lower, open, fluency, vibration. Uh, the letter Ta has five, whisper, strong, lower, open, forbidden. Letter Tha has five, whisper, weak, lower, open, forbidden. Letter Jim has six, apparent, strong, lower, open, forbidden, and vibration. 
the letter uh, ha has five whisper weak lowered open and forbidden uh, the letter five whisper uh, the letter ha sorry has five whisper weak elevated open and forbidden the letter del has five apparent strong lower open forbidden and a vibration the letter del has five apparent weak lowered open and forbidden the letter uh, ra which is the, the the only letter which has seven characteristics uh, apparent in between lowered open fluency deviation and repetition the letter z has six apparent weak lowered open forbidden uh, and whistle the letter c uh, six as well whisper weak lowered open forbidden and whistle the letter uh, sheen has six whisper weak lowered open forbidden and spreading around uh, the letter sod has six whisper weak elevated adhesion forbidden and uh, whistling the letter Bad has six apparent weak elevated adhesion forbidden and lengthening the letter Ta has six apparent strong elevated adhesion forbidden and, vib uh, and vib uh, vibration the letter va has five apparent weak elevated adhesion and forbidden. The letter ain has five apparent in between lowered open and forbidden. The letter gain has five apparent weak elevated open and forbidden. The letter fa has five whisper weak uh, lowered open and fluency. The letter qaf has six oh, uh, apparent strong elevated open forbidden and uh, vibra vib vibration. Uh, the letter kaf has five whisper strong lowered open and forbidden the letter lamb has five apparent in between lowered open fluency and deviation uh, the letter uh, sorry the letter lamb has six apparent in between lowered open fluency and deviation the letter meme has six apparent in between lowered open fluency and uh, gunna the letter uh, noon has six apparent in between lowered open fluency and gunna uh, the letter uh, ha has six whisper uh, weak lowered open forbidden and concealment and the letter wow has five apparent weak lowered open and forbidden uh, the letter yeah has five apparent weak lowered open and forbidden the letters of uh, med uh, alif uh, wow and yeah has six apparent weak lowered open forbidden and uh, concealment the letters of ease uh, wow and ya preceded by uh, fatha has six apparent weak lowered open forbidden and ease uh, th th this is the end of the chapter of characteristics uh, you should just keep going through it until you become familiar with the, uh, the characteristics and uh, as I told you, this is the two chapters which Tajweed, all Tajweed goes back to. And uh, this is what makes uh, a skilled reader. So if you hear somebody is reading, uh, he's reading the verses and he's scaling the words and he's scaling the, 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 the timing of the second, he gives them the right scale. That's what beautifies uh, the sound. And... Uh, before this, this reader, before he reached that stage, he he must have worked hard uh, to learn the different timing of the second, the articulation point, the, the attributes, and so on. So nothing comes out uh, like this. We have to work hard and practice and keep going through uh, the lessons, keep going through practicing the verses, the surahs, you know, until inshallah you... Uh, you you will reach the level of uh, a skilled reader, inshallah. Uh, this is the end of uh, the chapter of characteristics and, and uh, we finished the articulation point. Inshallah, we're going to start now the different chapters, which they're going to be... Uh, the first one we're going to go through, inshallah, the two meeting of... Uh, the, sorry, the meeting of the two letters, inshallah. Until next time, subhanakallah, bihamdik, shadu Allah, ilaha illa ant, astaghfiruka wa atubu ilayk.